There's... Ow. Ow. All right, let's start it up. We are back in the game of Deceiving. We're playing Chavez here today um, on Sound Eclipse, obviously. <laughs> um, and, well, Chavez didn't get any changes in the patch, but, like, I haven't played Chavez for a little bit. I think I played him, like, just before the patch, so it was kind of Chavez time, and also he's fun. That's really it. Um, so... It's a Chavez video. I don't really have a good reason. We're just playing Chavez because it's fun. Um, there's a key code in there. Now I really want in there. Go in there. Dang. I can hear the key code in there. I just need to get in and not die on the way. So there's Chavez 2, 2, and 3, which is probably in competition with like 3, 2, 3 for the best Chavez build. Honestly, just... 2-3, X-2-3, whatever, whatever weapon you want. Expertise 2, passive 3 is probably going to get you some of the best Chavez uh, games you can do. Ah, oh, there we go. The only reason I went in here is really for the key card, because, like, we're not going to get enough until we get through the next door. So we're probably just going to get the key card and get, head over to, like, A or B, and then come back here later. Yeah. Although, oh, okay. I guess this guy's not heading in. Okay. Yep, not heading in. Could check more drawers, but again, there's no way there's going to be six more intel in there, so let's just head out. Cue somewhere else. So this weapon's really good. Um, it's kind of the, the fast-firing, low-damage weapon of Chavez. 18 to the body, 24 to the head. Um, you get nine shots before you have to reload it, which is kind of a lot. And the reload's really quick. It's like one second or something. 1.1 seconds. It's really quick. So even if you do have to reload it, um, you know, you, you can do that pretty easily. Dog running. Let's take a look. Uh, seems pretty okay. All right, one more. Nope, not in there. Whatever, leave that draw open. And, uh, yeah, then we have Expertise 2, which is probably his best. Um, just the ability to uh, get damage resistance in an AoE around you. 25% less damage, I believe, is just really strong. 20%? Yeah, it's almost here. Um, so just taking less damage, always good, as long as you can keep the fight in your field or at least gain enough advantage while you're in your field to um you know win the fight then it's good the one thing you got to be a little careful of is people trying to like move or readjust the fight so that you can't fight while you're in your field which is what you should be doing if you're trying to play against chavez um i didn't get that but it's okay Let's head over to B, I guess. Oh, nice. oh, green key card might come in handy later. And, uh, yeah, then we have passive three. There we go. So we're going to have gray health when we take damage. And when we shoot back, we're going to heal some health up. Really strong ability. As long as we're healing at least 25 health with this. It's better than passive 2. And healing 25 health with this is not all that difficult. Um, and passive 2, you have to sit there and micromanage that 25 bonus HP, so... Better luck elsewhere. I mean, I knew someone was here. I just was hoping they were still here. But it seems like... No, we will get a purple out of this. I didn't really see if the blue was still there or not. But been a little bit rough mostly because of where we spawned we spawned new c didn't get a lot of intel did get ourselves a blue key card which is gonna like already has saved us 15 intel right there but we just never made it into c which um yeah we didn't make it to our closest spot so we had to spend a lot of time there and then um had to yeah we had to spend a lot of time getting to c and we didn't really get anything out of it yeah, we do get this, though. 
We are like slowly filling out a decent loadout here. We could at any point go get a green, but it's a little out of the way. We can head back to C at this point. Updating coordinates. So kind of likely if A and B were done, someone's probably already hit up C. Oh, get in. Okay, well, shoot better than I do. That's my suggestion. That was some terrible shooting, but I haven't had to shoot anyone for a minute. <laughs> I didn't realize that was a vigil for a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but our loadout has got significantly better all of a sudden. Gaining that purple key card and gold chip, which I guess we would have got because we were heading to sea anyway. But there we go. Should have thrown the goo pod. Forgot I had it, not gonna lie. But now we're in. Yeah, we were hitting for 18, so we had to land like six shots. Um, maybe even seven if they had a chip. I didn't do the math quickly, but you gotta land a lot of shots. Which, like, isn't really a big deal, but it kind of was. <laughs> it shouldn't have been as big a deal as it was. But uh, a little out of practice, I guess, on this. The bounce pad play was a little weird. I think if they just shielded, like they went into the purple room and dropped their shield as an actual wall, um, that would have been a problem. <laughs> but I don't know if they misclicked it, like that's what they meant to do. And that's when the bounce pad came out. But the bounce pad play wasn't amazing there. Um, other than that, they did, got, they, they almost got away really. Um, all right, but now we've ended up with an excellent loadout. And we can head on down. We didn't even, like, they didn't really shoot back, so we didn't get to see our expertise there or anything. And there we go. Let's see what we have in store for phase three. Two people right next to each other. They probably either know and don't care. Because now it's kind of like a 2v1 at this point, or they just don't know. Um, Not so out of touch, am I? Just top up on Intel, which probably shouldn't have while I was down here. But we'll see what we can do. Okay, oh they're just not close to us. Red, and I didn't see the other one that time. Playing against red, we gotta worry a little bit about the charm because it will neutralize us, uh, which can stop our expertise too. Shoot. Where's the other person? Oh, the other person's not nearly as close as I thought they were. Um, okay. They're just down, yeah. Uh, I don't know my bounce pad. If I had my bounce pad, I could bounce right up to B and... No, I can call it on the other side. Yeah. Bounce pad dying there was a little bad, but I needed to get up that staircase without Red just spraying me down. So, that's what we did. Need to change disguises. The one NPC whose name I always forget. Kidding, there's a couple NPCs whose name I always forget. Are they on this floor? Uh, now they're gone? Well, I'm gonna get on the thing and be confused where they went. Because there they are. Hey, wait. We can chill for a sec, hang on. They're stuck because the shield's a wall. Hello? Oh, I lost tracking. This is just me being annoying at this point. I should just hop on the point, I guess. Mm -hmm. 
I don't know where they went. Oh, I, I guess I'm just gonna hop on the point. I shouldn't be trying to do this. It might be considered mean. I just wanted to kill them, but our gun does have some serious damage fall off at that range. So even though I hit them a bunch, it just didn't matter. They were probably one shot when they did like, we'll say get away. Um, but uh, yeah, obviously we didn't really see our expertise though. Um, I didn't really feel the need to use it at any point. So we'll probably try in game two here. Let me click play to see what that's all about. And uh, yeah, I'll try to actually use it. <laughs> um, but most of the fights were just people running away from us rather than turning and shooting. But I will see you guys in game two. All right, we're back for game two. We got Hard Cell here, which is just a great map. Pretty full lobby as well. And away we go. Nice gray safe to start us off. And wow, look at all the goodies they're getting us. Okay. Um, I think we're gonna do something a little dumb. This is yeah, no. This is this is not smart. Hope they get a break once in a while. Um, yeah, it's probably a big waste of time, but we're gonna take this outer edge here around. And uh well, if there's someone we're gonna try to bounce pad them off the map, but that's cool. That would be cool. But also just, you know. I was gonna usually do this to fill up on all this intel that's out here, but there's Ow. Ow. <gasps> Come on, give it to me. Their spy pack should have came, you know. Well, I'm gonna say we did it. Their spy pack's supposed to come back into the game. But it didn't. So there's a chance they're alive, but I'm going to claim that we did it. It almost killed us, <laughs> but I'm going to make the claim that did it. If we see that vigil again, it was the ivory costume. Then we'll know that something went tragically wrong, but I'm going to I'm going to say we did it. It doesn't really matter what happens at this point. I could lose the whole game. That was not the first time I've ever done that, but it was definitely the most picturesque. So, points. All right. The fact I called it out in advance feels like I set it up, but you know what? I didn't. Wow. That guy was kind of really wiggly, I'm not gonna lie. Now watch, it'll be like this dog, and I won't have anything to shoot him with, or to defend myself with. Okay, at least it's not that. Move along. Okay, wow, intel, and I need two more. It's very doable. Nice. Gotcha. Oh, this comic's not updated. This comic was kind of a hint at this season. So I kind of thought it might be updated, but I have to keep an eye out in the future, see if that does, in fact, get updated. Okay, not bad. Gets us enough intel to get our blue. No key codes or anything yet? Well, one key code. Actually, that key code's pretty important. So we're actually doing okay. We had some action to start. And... Well, we'll never live up to it again. That's that's <laughs> potentially the greatest start of a game I've had. Okay. Over to D. That looked weird, but I think it was because they were interacting with someone else, like, not interacting, what's the word? <laughs> Quick win. They were avoiding someone else, so it's probably fine. Alright, we can open our own door here, which is the least sus way to do it. Looks like somebody was here, so that's a player right there. Where are you going? Hey, uh, no need to check out D. On the C. 
interesting that the area outside there was scared. Ooh, okay. We're gonna grab the green on our right, and then we'll head to the vault. Okay, never mind. I kind of thought that might be a player because I came sprinting out. Yeah, we're gonna have heat by the time we get there. This is less than ideal. Ow. Ow. Okay. Okay. Not too bad. I was hoping for something a little more... Heat's almost gone, there we go. Okay, and this is a good confirmation NPCs actually use this door. Because I've never been sure. Yeah, of course someone's in front of us now. Right there, criminal. Traded for a tie? Giving Savandam a win? Not sure. Yep, someone won. Alright, well... We didn't see the one vigil, we bounced off the map, so I'm assuming they died, and for that reason, and uh, potentially that reason alone, uh, this is going up. This That was great. No notes. Perfect. Do like the video if you did enjoy it. Comment on your thoughts as always, and subscribe for deceiving content like this in the future, and I'll see you in the next one.